two, three, four. Brand new battery, it's all almost dead. Hey guys, we made it to the East Caney Creek Trailhead. We're about to head out on the uh, Buckeye Caney Creek Trail. We're gonna complete the loop. It's a nine and a half mile loop. So basically we're starting at the bottom of the hill at the East Caney Creek Trailhead. We have a, about a mile we're actually gonna climb up, just walk straight up the road um, to get to the Buckeye Trailhead. And from there we're gonna take the ridge line all the way to where it drops down by Katy Falls, and that's where we'll be camping tonight. But it's uh, December the 29th. Um, it's freezing cold. It's about 36 degrees right now. So this is my brother-in-law, Chris, and this is a shot of the trailhead. So this would be where we will end our hike. But we head out this way. So we're about halfway up on our way to the Buckeye Trailhead. But this is just kind of what it looks like. It's pretty easy, but I figure I might as well just get most of the uphill out of the way, make for an easier hike tomorrow. So we've made it to the Buckeye Trailhead. So we're about a mile in. About to finally get started on actual trail. Go through the arch. Oh, 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 down. There, it's official. Oh, that was a bad idea. There, it's official. Oh, no. Nothing shutting down on me. So we're making our way up the trail here. Kind of got a good vantage point. The Buckeye Trailhead, right that way. See the vehicles? A little bit chilly, but uh, it's not bad. Oh yeah. I'm trying to attempt to climb up. <laughs> the safe way. It's not bad once you get up here. See the trailhead back that way. That's the trail we came in on. Uh huh. Oh, my batteries are shot with this cold weather. Brand new battery, it's all almost dead. <laughs> yeah. See, look at that, look how narrow that is.
So we just topped off on Buckeye Mountain. Now we're starting to uh, descend a little bit towards East Hannah Mountain. But we're making some progress. Oh, that's cool. I hear a babbling brook down there. So that's Tall Peak right there. The tower up on top. So we're kind of uh, getting to the point where we're about to see East Hannah Peak and start making our way down. Uh, we found this pretty sweet campsite up on the ridge. Here's the view to the north side. If you're wanting to camp up on the ridge, this is probably the best campsite that we've seen. It's got plenty of space for tents. No water though. The mighty winds from the north are blowing in. My fingers are like numb. So now it feels warm again. Getting there. Too close. It's getting there. It's getting chilly though. It's raining on us. We got a nice view up here, but I'll be danged if it's starting to rain. It's a pretty view though. Yay. Yeah, that's good. Looks like we're about to drop down. Oh yeah, hey. All right, I think we're starting to go down a little bit. Here's a little bit of a view of where we're at. Let's see. See, we're starting to go down a little bit. There's East Hannah right there. And some water from creek another babbling brook so we came from that way we've been going down this spine right here um, it's open up to this valley 
Ah, oh, you can hear the creek down there. Think of it. Anyways. So now we're going down. These leaves are slippery. This guy named Chris and he's got a pair of slacks. Ooh, Chris got slacks. They're dockers. Dockers. Bugle boy? So I guess we're kind of on the edge of East Hannah Mountain. Getting closer to the bottom. Yeah. I don't hear the creek though. I know. I know. Maybe it's a waterfall. Probably so. All right, so we finally made it to camp. We found a campsite kind of where Katie Creek and Caney Creek lie together so we're in the middle here but it's super flat ground and it's up high enough but uh yeah so check out the site nice little fire pit and someone left us a nice little kindling stack so I believe this is Caney Creek not a bad campsite though well, we got our tent set up right there in the middle here. We got Chris over here getting us some water to filter because we're all out. Chris! Believe it or not, the water's cold. Boom! Right. That's some fine mountain water right there. We have finally got a fire pretty much going. For some margraves. Worked it real good. Tim, how you did it? Tried to find something dry in this wet forest. Everything is saturated right now, so we're having a little bit of a hard time. But uh can't complain about the view. Got our water, got our tents. About to uh, make some dinner. All right, so we got a fire going. About to do some dinner. Probably call it a night. So we are at the Y between. Caney Creek and Katy Creek. Katy Falls is up the hill and probably about a quarter mile away. Hey guys, I just wanted to share with you probably the best beer to backpack with, the Mosaic IPA Community Beer Company in Dallas, Texas. It's 8.6% ABV, so it's like two beers in a can. So, split a six pack between a buddy, the load didn't get too heavy in this pack. I'll show you guys. This is the uh, rock kern that shows where 
the Buckeye Trail joins the Caney Creek Trail. So when you get to this rock stack and you're close to the creek, you'll see the Y of Katy Creek and Caney Creek joining together right there. So when you get to that rock pile, take a left if you're gonna continue on East Caney Creek. Made it to Katy Falls. Nice little view. You guys, we're packed up camp. Uh, about to head out on the East Caney Creek Trail. Um, again, we are at the Y of Caney Creek and Katy Creek. So the trail comes across the creek right there, and you can kind of see it continues on up the hill. And that's the uh, Caney Creek Trail, so that's where we're heading. Do you ever heard there's some big rattlesnakes up here? Uh-huh. Those uh, timber rattlers. Okay. Caney Creek to the right of us down there. Kind of more than the same. We crossing? Yeah, it looks like it. Go for it, sir. I just picture a unicorn topping up the hill. It's magical. Well, let's uh, let's count on 34, and then maybe we'll be pleasantly surprised. It's a pretty section here, though. So that's what the second actual crossing. Yeah. So after that second creek crossing, you got quite a bit of uphill, a lot more elevation change once you pass it. You see the creek straight down that way. Still not bad though. Got tall peak right there. And again, I'm quite a bit a ways up above Caney Creek. And back down by the creek again. I think we're getting close. I say that a lot though. It's 
pretty spot. Gonna see a bright red truck. Nope. Nothing. Nothing. More trail. More trail. And back downhill. I feel like you always turn the camera on just in case I fall. All right, we just made it back. Came back around this corner and finally saw that red Milwaukee truck. It's a good sight. All right, so we just finished the Buckeye Caney loop, uh, nine and a half miles with an additional one mile uh, that we took at the beginning of the hike up this road up to Buckeye Trailhead. But we just finished the hike, about to drive back towards Texas. Oh, well, here's the last shot of the creek. Nice little getaway.